Good evening, side friend. This is Mitty Man coming back at you. Another word for the day. This is Nightcap Edition, people. Um, I was not going to do a video, but uh, I just saw something that I just had to come back and uh, comment on. I thank you all. First of all, let's give a shout out to the YouTube fam from Baby Justice all the way up to Big Papa JT as well as Mama JT. End Time Harvest Game. Brother LA for Kingdom Knowledge. Elder Michael McCray. Lake Sister 777. Lady D, Sister Kate, everybody, Len Linda, Late uh, uh, Leonard, Papa, Brother JT, Brother Orange Flavor, Brother PB Drawing, Brother Hot and Cliff as well. Uh, like I said, people, I <clears throat> just saw a video that uh, Brother Brother PP Drawing sent me personal, uh, and I'm quite sure he may have sent it to some of the rest of you as well about this persecution that going on, the church going on in uh, Nigeria. Um, I had the privilege, and uh, matter of fact, uh, I, we want to give a shout out to our sister, Grace Truth Teacher, that's her channel, on YouTube. And she's the one that uh, had uh, the, the uh, relaying of this in information to us. But I wanted to speak on something that uh, Brother P.P. Drawing made a statement in his, uh, in his email about this video and he posed the question and he said that he wondered is these here prosperity pre preaching leaders and watered down saints if this same kind of persecution was going on right here would they still claim to know God as these saints that went down and they lost their lives for their faith that's a good question brother PP drawing that's a good question and if we can't answer that question with the with the unadulterated yes then maybe we should go back again and just really see exactly who we really own. It's it's just it's real simple, people. Uh, from what I see, when I was watching the video, I went. It was at uh, the the Sister Grace Te True Teacher site, her YouTube channel, where I actually watched the video. And uh, it's 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 amazing. It's it's really good. But see, like I said, it doesn't surprise me because we know persecution happened before. And it is happening now. And if we know God's word to be true, which I believe it, it's going to get even worse. It's going to become worldwide. Or well, you're going to have to make a stand for what you believe in. You're going to have to separate the wheat from the tear. In other words, uh, it's something that Grace Truth Teacher said in her video that me and Brother L.A., I know we've talked about it more times than I got fingers and toes. That, uh, the key and the mark of a believer, true believer, is the love. Jesus said so. It's in the Word, people. The only people that don't know that is the people that don't don't get into the Word and don't study the Word. But that is the true acid test for all believers: is love, the love they're gonna have for one another. And by the Christ, like I said, we see those brothers and sisters falling down in in Nigeria, and people that should be a wake up call for all of us. Because if it's happening there now, it won't be long. So we need to get ready. If we cannot have the same conviction as I could say, those that have fallen already, if we cannot have the same conviction, and if if, if, if you know when you know within your heart that you just don't have that type of same conviction, you need to pray and ask God for it. Because that's the kind of conviction that we just need to endure these end times. Some of us people gonna fall. We're gonna fall. Some of us gonna fall by the sword. That's that's just automatically. In other words, when I was in the military, every time we, if we went out when if you go out for a campaign in battle zone, it may not be on foreign soil, it might be on your native soil. But it they always say some of us may not get back. In other words, when we go out on the C one thirty, I mean you know, you may not even get to the combat zone. The plane could be shot down. We never know. So they always tell us that some of us may not make it back. But we don't worry about that. We're going to do what we must do. 
same thing it is I believe with being a child of God. We know that we are marked for death. More, more point blank. The world hates us. Why? Because it hated Jesus. They killed him, didn't they? They don't care nothing about you and me either. So with that said, we just glad that the sister put up the video. I hope all of us sees it. I hope everybody in the entire harvest game see the video and see exactly what's going on in the world. And if it's happening there now, beware. Beware. With that being said, it's Middle Man saying have a blessed weekend. Remember, whatever you get, whatever you get into, if God is not in it, you get out of it. Stay out of it. It's Middle Man saying peace and good night.